Hey everyone, change in plans. For the record, my voice just did this. I am not sick, haven't had a cold, I'm not coughing, sneezing, nothing. My voice is just crazy. There's moments of clarity in my voice, and then moments like this where I'm practically screaming to get this out. Anyways, there has been a change in plans in my diet. I just found out on Saturday that I am pregnant. Um, definitely wasn't in the books, definitely shed lots of tears, um, but the reality of the situation is that I'm having a third child. I don't know how I'm going to do it or what I'm going to do. So, yeah. Anyways, my plan is not to get back. Okay, so without like telling exactly what I weigh, basically if I gain more than like 25 pounds, I'm going to be putting myself back out of Wonderland. And that's not something that I'm willing to do. Uh, I think I could go 28 or 29 pounds. Anyways, so I am still pretty much following MetaFast food guidelines right now. Um, the only difference is is that I'm netting a thousand calories. I am eating back what I work out. So I am probably consuming more like 1,200 calories in a day, give or take. Not give, but probably take. Um, <coughs> excuse me, that one made me cough. Get that whatever's wrong with my throat. Anyways, I'm like netting 12, 100, 1,000 calories a day for the first trimester, um, and then after that is when you do need to up your car, um, calorie intake. However, the one thing I'm going to continue on this pregnancy is doing high-protein, low-carb diet. Um, what I've been doing is eating. Um, I have really bad morning sickness. Anybody that knows me personally knows that I have hyperemesis with my pregnancies, which means it starts with normal morning sickness, and then it's just like violent throwing up. After a certain period for the entire pregnancy, I'm heavily medicated for it. Um, and that, along with that comes its own issues. So I have been sick already, even though I'm only five and a half weeks. Um, well, usually I start about seven or eight weeks, and I've started really early. See my kid or my dog. Um, I started really early this pregnancy, unfortunately. Um, so what I've been doing is eating um, a bar in the morning. I have some Fiber One meal replacement bars or even some Target bars um, right away in the morning slowly um, to try to keep that down. Um, and then like right now I'm actually making an egg. So I'm going to eat an egg. It's an organic, um, grass-fed, no antibiotic, free-range, whatever. Really good for you egg. Uh, and then at lunchtime I eat another bar. And then I eat a lean and green at dinner. So I eat like the five meals a day um, and net around 1,000 calories and about 80 to 90 carbs, grams of carbs a day. Um, yeah, so game changer. So I am actually restarting up. Um, I have a blog called naptimeblitz.com that just really has gone to the wayside with everything else because work has been insane. But I am going to try to start it back up again and I'm going to start a different mommy channel. But once I get it posted up, I'll link it below. I'll come back here and keep doing like how my diet's going and my weight and exercising. But I'm going to do like my journey of pregnancy and mommyhood to three, three children on my other channel. So you're welcome to come subscribe there. Um, but like I said, I still will do all my normal weights and all of that here. I just feel like you guys probably don't want to see the mommy stuff, and so I want to give you a chance just to kind of separate it. Um, can't promise anything over there just because I try, but sometimes my priorities in life are not YouTube because it's not my job. Anyways, I hope you guys are all doing fantastic, and I will check in with you guys on Sunday with my weigh-in. Which will probably be bad because I did this. I've been on vacation this whole week and I've tried really hard to stay on plan, but I really haven't. Everything in moderation was the theme of this week, and I don't know how it's going to affect my weight. So I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.